some stage? Uh, yeah, yes and no. I just I thought that yeah, when the first half I was really happy with it, apart from yeah, we just couldn't ice uh, some opportunities that uh, you know we we're going to need to. But um, you know, the first round and uh, the boys short pre-season like, and they had you know, a lot of footy and all the cowards to their credit, they were. Um, pretty desperate in defence and they were rushing up and yeah so second half I think the game got a bit yeah got a bit sloppy I think and uh, yeah in the end we'll, we'll go over two points and with a fair bit to work on. I don't care, back in Hawaii. Like, the, the streak starts again. The streak uh, no, starts again all over no, the grand final um, and then losing the final again. Yeah. Round one's always a long game anyway. The second half, yeah, from the footy I've been watching, um, starts again. feels like it goes on forever. And, um, so that was always our. I'm having you know, an um, exactly you, you know, looking for a long, hard game. Mate, it's a long uh, season. Mate, I mean, I would have taken the points in the it's first half, split. but um, as I said, I was it's pretty happy with that. You know, we just it's weren't it's nice and the opportunities. Split. We were getting ourselves in good field position. We were defending well. We were putting pressure on them. You know, we're never going to play our best football tonight. No, I think that showed. What's the limit for your left edge? Yeah, I like the times they look totally the result. Like, the boys against men at the times out there. It's a marathon. So they don't only have time to send it in the season. If we think we can get better. So, yeah. I think, um... Yeah, Brian Toto was one of our best tonight. Um, you know, he's changed sides this year. He was outstanding. Um, yeah, I actually think our combinations can, can certainly get better based on what I saw. But, uh, yeah, we, we think we've got a, yeah, some good opportunity out there. Yeah, just quite naturally. Um, said before when we came back to pre-season those guys uh, both of them just kind of took over um, organically which was nice because was, that's the thing I the decision I was thinking about but I hadn't said, I hadn't said that to them um, yeah, I feel like it was never going to hurt their performances um, and it might even help them so yeah tonight showed that you know, they're both they've had good pre-seasons are in good nick and played yeah I thought they played pretty well I don't care if it was a better player than Nathan. I don't care if it was better than Nathan. Yeah, I was very happy with that last that last play. Because um, I thought we would, yeah, I thought we mentally we weren't totally engaged for the last sort of 10 minutes, I didn't think. Um, I did, I did. Which is, you know, it's probably a little bit understandable. We'd, we'd like to set our sights a bit higher than that. Uh, but yeah, to the credit, they came up with a good stop at the end. It's never easy to, yeah, hold up to zero, especially, you know, I know they they probably wouldn't say they had their best game, but um, they got a lot of strike in that side, and they put us under pressure around the ruck uh, throughout that second half. Front. I mean, I'm, you know, we'll have to find out, but I, I, I feel that, you know, I feel like our, our team is well connected. I feel like they're um, you know, taking responsibility for themselves from what I've seen in the training and already. Um, so, whilst you don't have those older, older guys there, um, we're happy with the squad we have, and I think that we've got a lot of guys capable of leadership, and, you know, as I said, being able to take responsibility for themselves you know, when they're out there and that's yeah, but I guess time will tell it's a long year.